Hey guys, it's Chaos Maelstrom here, and welcome back to more Disgaea Hour of Darkness. Last time, we went to the Forest of the Dead and met Don Joaquin, the ghost of the original Defender of Earth who wishes to challenge the Overlord. And in this episode, we are going to follow after him to grant that request. So, um, now, I want to go ahead and take the time to show that actually I don't have anything to show. I was just prepared to do something, but... Whatever, I'll probably re-equip myself again on screen with some of the more better equipment. Um... I really forgot what I was gonna say now, um... Oh well, I guess we'll just go straight into the game, I guess. Right, here we go with Crawling Terror! Yeah, rising Fear and Crawling Terror, what's next? Uh, jumping... Horror? I don't know. Huh? What's wrong, Thursday? Oh, no! The shock from that old man's attack has short-circuited him. Can you repair him, Jennifer? Even though I built Thursday when I was five, I can't fix him without the proper equipment. Beep, beep, blip. Oh, the damage to the memory circuit is extensive. If Thursday overheats, then his entire memory will be lost. Hmm, that leaves me no choice. Thursday, you're going to have to sit on the sidelines for now. Beep, blip, beep. Whoa, wait, Thursday can fight. I won't allow it. We can't afford to lose you. Gordon's right. You heard what I said, didn't you? Your memory could be lost. If that happens, you'll forget about Gordon and I, and all the wonderful memories that we've shared together. Bitch. Gibbs. Thursday. Fight. Anyway. Thursday. Even though Thursday robot, Gordon and Jennifer call Thursday friend. Thursday. Happy. Thursday want to show gratitude. Thursday may lose memory if participation is resumed. Lose memory. Very sad. But being useless even more sad. That is why Thursday fight alongside you until very end. Thursday! <laughs> What's wrong? You gotta go? No, he doesn't. He's been touched by Mr. Thursday's heart. Heart? Robots have hearts? What are you saying? Thursday's words are the very heart of a defender of Earth. It doesn't matter if he's human or robot. He has the same spirit burning deep inside of him. Thursday! Yes. Captain Gordon? Your noble spirit has touched my heart. No matter what the outcome, I will be proud to fight beside you. Now join us, Thursday! Me, me. Thank you, Captain. Thursday, so glad to have met you. That makes me tear up a little. Oh. Good lord. This is why I love Thursday so much. He is one of the best characters in the game. Oh. Okay. Now. That brings me to something I want to say. Even though I love that 
Episode 11 as an episode is probably one of my least favorite episodes in the game. Not because of story-wise. Story-wise, it is brilliant. It's, I'm talking about design-wise. Design-wise, it is jerkish. I mean... I mean, the scenery is kind of dreary and really pretty much unappealing. So, that's why I don't like it as much as other chapters. I bet you're wondering what I'm doing here. You s well, I will say this. You saw those things all the way at the end there, right? Well, that's what I'm trying to do right here. I'm trying to... Make a big conga line of people to toss over there. That's what I mean to say. Something like that. Uh, no, no, no. That's too dangerous. I won't allow... Okay, maybe I'll allow a little bit. Heck, if Thursday can tough it out for us, so can Lucille. But I'm not going to be the one to let her get hurt, so... I'm going to make a tower with as many people as I can to throw over there. And also, hey Charlie, you still have some uses. So, you're going to throw Lucille as far as you can this way. Maybe not next to the enemies. Because, um, sorry Cameron, but it's the only way that I can efficiently toss people. Uh, I can take this guy, uh, I'll throw Jennifer this way. Jennifer will. Not toss Gordon into a bottomless pit, but throw him this way, and... Uh... Okay, and now we're counting on you. Throw Laharl! Throw Laharl as hard as you can! Alright. Now, I'm gonna get off an Overlord's Wrath on these Geo Symbols. It's the, our best option right now, and it will weaken the enemies considerably. I'll do the next thing with those other Geo symbols after this. Really wish there were some negative effects we could put on those Geo symbols, but no, of course not. And yes, okay, we got rid of a chunk of the effects that are good for the enemies. I will now try my best to position our units in a way that they will take the least damage possible. All right, Charlie's probably gonna die, but who cares? Oh, they know. You cheap bastard! You cheap bastard! Oh, and you're gonna go all the way over there for Charlie! Wow, they really like using their Mega Wind, don't they? Stop Mega Winding Cameron! Cameron wants none of your wind! What did I just say? If, if Cameron dies to this just because... I'm speechless! I literally took the time out to improve Cameron's defenses and such, and then the enemies go and combo him! The enemies really hate Cameron! I, I just imagine him sitting there on the field, just ranting about heroes and justice and whatnot. Maybe that's, maybe that's why he's such a big target, because he just never shuts up on the field. <laughs> but, man, okay, I'm gonna... Mega heal Jennifer to ensure that we don't lose another unit. Here I go. That's why you want to make sure that you get rid of this guy, these guys, as soon as possible. Normally I wouldn't do this for just anybody, but I'm going to do another Overlord's Wrath. Which means, bite the dust! Bite the dust. Yeah! You tell him, Harl! Uh, yeah, see what I mean? Stages here are annoying. And believe it or not, there's one stage after this that's even more annoying! That I super hate! Because it gave me lots of trouble when I first played this game. Um, I'm going to Hurricane Slash you. And Impaler you. Impaler you. That's, oh wait, no, Asteroid Drop will get two of one of them, so. Just have an asteroid drop, even though that won't do much to him. Uh, I'll have Gordon and Jennifer get this guy. So Vossel Fisher. And Jennifer, I guess, will follow up with a Starbuster. And 
now, I guess Etna will add with another asteroid drop. And I can't really do much with my other units, considering I lost some. Thanks to the stupid friggin'... <sighs> and to think, I went out and made efforts to improve Cameron's endurance and defenses after the last... After the last check after the last segment of the stage, so... And they just combo him into oblivion! I wouldn't normally say this, but... Stop being so mean to Cameron! He didn't do anything to deserve that much abuse! And these guys are really annoying. Just how tough are these guys? Oh. I do not like them. We, we need... We need Laharo power now. And... Oh. Oh. They're all pretty strong. I guess that would help explain it. Um... Well. I know who I'm going to be training up after this. By that, I mean pretty much everyone. Stop using Mega Wind. Jeez. Hold on, Jennifer. Okay. Good. I'm guessing Fawn is our designated healer for today. Now, to get Laharl over here and Hurricane Slash this dude. Hurricane Slash this dude, dude! Ah, uh, we haven't seen Prinnies in such a long time. Mainly because I stopped... Maybe because they're base, base monster class, and you can stop using them after a while, but... Jeez, I stopped using them really friggin' fast. When was the last time I used one? Like, Chapter 4? I, I, that's another thing. I really gotta stop calling these chapters. I know they're episodes, but... Jeez. Not the easiest thing to do. I'll oh, tiger charge him. Gordon shall destroy love! Yeah. Unless Fawn has something to say about it, but considering love is our enemy here. Yeah, it's a bad idea to have love as your enemy. Uh, really? Looks like I... I pretty much almost destroyed Joker there, but... One more attack should do it. Um, can I dispatch any more units? I can't! Okay, well, Thursday. You said you wanted to fight, so I shall grant your request to... Wait, can I get him over to the... No, not quite. I want to have him get off a robo bazooka. But still, I shall grant your request to fight Thursday. Because you are such a trooper. Thursday is a trooper! He's almost on par with a certain red leaf, but we don't talk about him, apparently. Alright. Let's go ahead and start our attack. Alright, got rid of that guy. Oh, Laharo leveled up yet again! I'm just doing another asteroid drop as Etna to get off some more... Damage on those guys. Mega heal on Jennifer because she needs it after these enemies troll her. This tiger charge should kill him. Yeah, way to go, Jennifer! Alright, she leveled up too. Uh, deplete his defense like that. Um, okay. I was expecting a nickel, that's okay. And Thursday, do your best, bro! That's what I'm talking about, even though there's still just a little bit left of him. Oh, wait, you know, he's dead. Wait. What? Why did you not counter? There was literally no reason for him not to counter there. He's still at... Okay. This stage is being a dick to me. That's the only explanation. The stage is pulling out all the stops just to be a dick. I really hate this stage, in case you couldn't tell. That's because this episode... That's 
the reason why I don't like this episode as much as others. It's full of a bunch of stages I hate! Wait, don't you dare combo up Thursday. If you combo up on Thursday, I will never forgive you! Okay, thank God. Gonna kill this guy now. I want to have Lucille add in an attack just to ensure that we defeat him. Hopefully, we won't have to add one to the combo attack glitch counter. And have Laharo come over here and blade rush these guys. Can we not? No, we cannot. I thought so. Okay, we'll do the next best thing and hit him with a wind cutter then. I hope he'll be able to hit those guys with a wind cutter. Have Gordon do another special, and Etna will follow up with an Impaler. Uh, I'll move Jennifer over to some of the other areas now. Uh, I'll have Flan shift into attack mode. I will shift Flan into attack mode and attack your life points directly! <clears throat> yes, obligatory reference was needed. Uh, can't, she can't reach anyone now, so I'll just have her defend for now. And... I guess that's all I can really do. Thursday leveled up again! Excellent! I'll finish this. No wonder I'm having such trouble with this stage. All these enemies are a lot tougher than I am for the most part. Uh, and of course that guy had to... I really should start checking the range on my attacks more. I won't hold back! Yes, please don't hold back, Juan. We want to kill all these guys, remember? How do you do that little damage? Okay. There you go! Countered that time! Even though you didn't... Okay, I'm going to have Thursday move back over here, just in case the enemies decide to attack him with Mega Wind again. Alright. Stupid, stupid winged imps. Oh. I am in bad condition now. Yeah, I think I might actually have Thursday retreat for a bit. Oh god, I'm about to die. I'm about to die. I'm a- Oh! Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Whoa! Woo! Okay, that was way too close for comfort. Okay, Thursday. Thank you for being a trooper, but right now I need my healer. Okay. Um. I can take some more poison, but. I don't know about that. Ooh, Glaxia learned Giga Heal again. Excellent. Uh, just to heal. Just so I can get two birds with one stone, I'll heal Lucille as well. Heal Lucille. <laughs> it rhymes. <laughs> I'm a woodpecker! <laughs> Except with dirt. Okay, I don't think there was actually any need for Giga Heal right there, but... Hey, I do what I can, when I can do it. That sounds like a wonderful saying. I do what I can, when I can do it. Um, I'm gonna try Winged Slayer, because I'm... Whoa, you like to get rid of these guys! Also, Cosmic Arrow. Cosmic Arrow, just to add to the combo of these two guys. And... I guess I'll leave Flan right there to take care of any stragglers who happen to survive this. No, I will just go over here and attack. And... Gordon can't really do much as he is, so I will have him give Etna a toss in this direction. So she can, I guess... Attack Kiwi! Good lord, this stage is annoying. I'm not gonna hit Jennifer, am I? No, no, she's not. In the range, so. Yeah, we are good. We are good to go. Cosmic arrow. The Coup de Grasse. Okay, got rid of that guy. I had a feeling that guy over there would be able to survive. And let's get an avalanche this one. There I go again, talking about everything I'm doing without actually really talking about something. But. Uh, what can you do? I mean, 
Everything in this game takes a long time. You run out of stuff to talk about easily. Let's see, which one of you presents the bigger problem? Um, I can take a bit more poison. I'm gonna kill you. Yeah. <laughs> oh, uh, how about how about this case of irony? I'm gonna kill you with Mega Wind. Yeah, how do you like that, huh? <laughs> oh, that felt good. Uh. I think I might do some grinding off screen after this chapter because, good lord, if if I'm having trouble with this stage, the stages after this are going to be an absolute horrifying nightmare. Okay, we only got two more enemies left. I'm gonna hit Jennifer some more. Juana has good resistance, so it's not going to do as much to her. And there we go. Um, I'll have Laharl kill you. And I would like to get as many people over here to combo this guy as possible. Just to be a jerk to him because he was such a jerk to us. Uh, Etna's can't get over there any further, so... And I cannot get over there because apparently this tree is in the way. Alright, I'll just do the next best thing and hit it with a sword beam. Excuse me, wind cutter. Uh, I think that should be enough. Death. Gotcha. Death. Death. And. <laughs> okay. Thank you, Jennifer. Now then. And then at that's over with. Let's see what awaits us next. Okay, that's it then. That's the stage. All right then. Now, I know it's been a bit of a long episode, but I'm going to cut this part out, but I'm going to go grind a bit on that one stage that we saw here. That was very nice. Oh, really? So close. Oh, baby! Oh, and he's gonna counter kill him. Okay, well. Well, still. It's finally happened. Let me reset this stage to show you just what has happened. Now, just what have I done, you may ask? Well, Laharl is at level 50. What happens when you get Laharl to level 50? Nothing much, only you learn the single greatest skill in the game. Meteor Impact! This is Laharl's ultimate unique skill! Look at how much SP it costs. Now, but you're thinking, that's way too much. But, you haven't seen anything yet. This is the attack range of it. This is the attack I kept hinting at this entire time. Now, I already sent Michael to do a Braveheart. I manipulated the arena a bit to fill Laharl's attack area of effect. You want to see just what this attack does? Well, here you go. Here I come! That's what happens. And every time you use it, you get rewarded with that sweet, sweet laugh. Okay, I should really end the video right here because I really need to go number two. So next time on the Sky Hour of Darkness, we will chase down Don Joaquin and finish him off. Laters!